When I first came to Los Angeles in 1961, uh, and I first my first trip to Los Angeles, it was just the end of of the um, the old studio st star system. It was the end of it. I remember walking into the Universal Commissary, and it was completely empty. Of course, it was after lunch, and Spencer Tracy was sitting at a table having a cup of coffee all by himself, and I thought, that's it, it's all over. A studio picture is usually a sequel, a, a reboot, or a, a superman, superhero movie, or a cartoon, kind of cartoon. Um, that Paramount made Selma is unusual. Um, I think they should be complimented for doing it. I thought it was a good picture. Um, so everything's changed, not for the better. Now, it's funny, my most, my most uh, critically acclaimed picture, the last picture show, uh, Ultimo Spectaculo, I think, in Italy, um, was the one I recut more after, after it came out than any other picture. I think I made four different cuts of it. And when one came out, it said, the director's cut. Then the next one finally said, definitive director's cut, because I, I, I put back seven minutes, and I took out one minute. And, uh, and the, the version that exists now on, on DVD is, is the, f the definitive director's cut. It's a kind of a screwball comedy. Um, I, 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 I like the idea, the basic idea of the plot which is based on something that happened to us on St. Jack, which is a picture we made in the late 70s in Singapore. Met a lot of real pimps, real madams, real hookers. We used three of them in the picture, and two of them, I gave them money to stop doing what they were doing and to go home. One went back to Bangkok, another one went back to Malaysia. And um, so I, I like the idea of somebody giving a hooker money to stop being a hooker. That was the basic idea behind the plot. Then, then we, we, we obviously elaborated on that. But that was the co core idea. Be sort of perverse, you know, pay a hooker to stop being a hooker. I like screwball comedies. I like complicated comedies. What's Up Doc is like that. So there's a lot of characters, and they, they all crisscross, and it's 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 based on coincidence and uh, and uh, contrivance. Owen Wilson is a brilliant comic actor. He's a brilliant actor. Period. Comedy's more difficult to do than anything, and uh, he's great great com comic actor. Jennifer Aniston is a, doesn't play the leading role, but she, she wanted to play the therapist in the picture. She was the part she wanted to play. There's a girl, new girl named Imogen Poots, who's English, who just knocked me out when I met her. I thought she was just so interesting and uh, odd and quirky and uh, not like anybody I'd ever met. And, uh, so I cast her right away. <clears throat> and she did a great, great job in the picture. She's a, She's a brilliant actress.